And we started. Hello guys, we are Team B. Well, is it Arena, June, Sandy, and we is, uh, is on the Zoom call. Ah, uh, this is Wayne. Sales on North America 
and use it uh, towards the further development of all the product lines and consolidate uh, with this plan in the market. This plan brought up repercussions on sell and market loss. Mm -hmm. Therefore, for the following years, we slightly lowered the prices uh, on a range between 450 to 550 uh, hundred dollars uh, per camera. Uh, and uh, keep, uh, we kept upgrading uh, our product through the years, through all uh, regions. That method worked. As we recovered the market share we lost from the year nine, as well as we increase our credit rating to, uh, uh, as well as we increase our uh, credit rating to A plus here. For this, for our marketing strategy. So on year five and year six, we entered the market with three camera models to compete with the existing rivals uh, uh, in the market. But on year seven, we decided to drop the, the, the third camera model from the production line and focus on all the resources on two models. But for drones, uh, we kept two models for all years and mostly focus business to consumer method by lowering our online retail discount and choose uh, the number of distribution channels. So the customers uh, were purchasing the drones directly from us. Um, to the purpose was to keep upgrading the product and its quality, create value, and smoothly transit to best cost strategy. To increase customer confidence in the product, we offer um, three uh, 65 days warranty, so they are feeling confident about our product and purchase it, and this also helps us increase our PQ rating. Um, okay. For price, we use dynamic pricing strategy uh, to maintain optical, optimal balance between the number of the product sold and the uh, profit per product. Also by monitoring competition prices, change, and better understanding the supply uh, and the demand through the industry, we adjust and change the pricing uh, of our product through, di fro through different regions. So in each different region, we have different pricing. According to a customer uh, buyer power, uh, the competition there, and also what was the price of the competition. That strategy worked very well. So for place, we aim to have a market share on the geographical region. We distributed our product in North America, in Latin America, Europe, Africa, and Asia Pacific. Our goal was to have a brand image uh, in each continent and be internationally recognized. For promotion, we increased the promotion uh, the years, through the years to capture new market shares. So smoothly we were doing it. For example, from uh, year five to year 10, we offer 10% uh, of promotion for eight weeks, but not for North America. For North America, it only was for four weeks. Our promotion strategy was to persuade potential customers to buy the product from us and refer a friend. This strategy helped us to boost our brand awareness, increase sales, and gain competitive advantage. On year 11 and 12, we, uh, um, we offered 20% of promotion to prom shoppers to buy the product from us and gain sales from those who abandoned their carts, uh, awaiting uh, for better promotions, better deals to make the purchase. We put these two graphs together, so you can see how in year nine the camera sales uh, went down and the drone sales went up. The yin and yang of the sale industry. So, we doubled, actually I didn't finish, we doubled our marketing expenses on cameras and we tripled the marketing expenses on drone. We added additional feature to both products, 
but but because our PQ rating and brand reputation of drones and the increase of 77, so because of the PQ rating higher, better reputation on drone, the increase of 77% on the price from year eight to nine did not prejudicate the sales. While 87.5% of increase of, set up of uh, price on cameras from year eight to nine did the opposite. We saw that the decrease on camera was compensated by the increase of uh, drone sales. Okay, now we switch to our production strategy. Unfortunately, our production strategy was very weak since we did not expand or uh, like develop our workstation until year 12. Um, uh, we started as Irina explained, we started our company with three cameras and two drones that we decided to enter the, with low, stra low standards and low futures. But in year seven, we decided to switch that and improve our, our strategy and improve our product to two cameras and two drones and focus only on two cameras and two drones. Um, our employees had to work full time, uh, overtime, I mean, from year six all the way to year nine every year. And we did not focus on developing. We spent the money on paying them overtime instead of expanding the workstation. But in year 10 and year 11, because the demand went down, they didn't have to work any overtime to meet our demand. In year 12, when everything like stabilized and our demand went up, and we found out that we have more profit, we decided to expand our workstation. And uh, instead of paying, like investing our money in overtime, we invested our money in workstations. Um, but even though our employees had to work overtime, their productivity didn't go down. So we were able to like develop our product and the rating of our product went from four to seven out of 10 as a PQ. Okay, so this is me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you hear me? I, I can, I can see it. I can see it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, about conversation and uh, facilities, uh, our business management strategy mainly focus on developing uh, and improve, improving the product quality rather than the uh, station expansion. Uh, to if, to effectively achieve this, we give our employee uh, benefits every year. Like so. Uh, include uh, uh, incentives and uh, attendance bonus and uh, foreign back benefit package. Uh, we also kept increasing their salary like each year. Uh, as a retention bonus, uh, the salary uh, increment was increased pros progressively. Uh, as you can see, on the year six, we offer only one percent of salary increase, and the, for the following years, we increased to. Uh, 3%. We also increase specific bonus such as attendance bonus from uh, $800 to uh, $1,500. Uh, we increase the employee's foreign uh, benefit package from $2,000 to uh, $5,200. Uh, as our revenue grow, uh, we were able to afford benefits improvement uh, for the employee to keep them to, to keep them motivated and help us to retain a qualified and sufficiently training uh, workforce. Uh, this conversation measure uh, also enhanced the productivity uh, of our company and we were able to expand the station in year 12. Uh, retention of the qualified and motivated workforce was the key of our, com of our company. Uh, next slide, please. Uh, the first chart uh, shows the conversation increase uh, with years. Uh, for total uh, compensation, like 25,000 uh, 25, per PAT member in uh, year five, 
and the value increased up to uh, 36,000 uh, per PTA members in, in year in, in year 12. And this this was a result of increasing bonus, uh, such like uh, attendance bonus and uh, foreign benefit package. Uh, we aim our motivating our workforce uh, to make sure the com to company uh, productivity increase to meet the marketing demand, uh, to improve the quality of our product. Uh, we, we, we invested in productivity improvement training or best practice of the workforce. Uh, our workforce productivity in terms of unit per uh, PAT uh, improved over the years uh, for the AC cameras and drone products uh, as even from the second chart. Uh, the increased uh, productivity can be attributed uh, to benefit packs to the employee and the enhancement of the production through investment in productivity, improving training. Uh, the, incre the increased productivity was a key uh, in meeting the market demand and improve our company's market share, uh, both in short and long term. Next, next slide. Thank you. So uh, our corporate citizen strategy was put on hold until year 10. Uh, that was in order to meet our uh, other company goals and objectives, uh, including uh, product quality improvement and increasing the market share in different markets. And you can see in year eight and year nine, we have to uh, stop our charitable contribution uh, and green activities to record our some of the company things and air earnings. And this helped to stabilize uh, the company revenue and to attain the uh, growth goals and uh, stabilization of earnings, we put money in uh, property citizenship strategy in year 10 uh, to increase the uh, charitable contributions and the maintenance of the supplier code of conduct. Uh, for example, I, uh, our charity contribution uh, increased from uh, 2.528 million in year 10 to 3.389 million. Uh, in year in year eleven, and this further increased to seven point seven five seven million in year twelve, and other crop, uh, other corporate uh, citizenship strategy we put in uh, like green energy and renewable energy program and improved uh, working conditions and the supplier code of conduct maintenance. Uh, our total cash layout in, uh, increased sharply in year ten after we began doing the uh, CSR and. You can you can see it, it's rising from the 0 0.7 per unit sale in year nine and to uh, 7 point, 7.83 per per unit sale in year ten, which is a, a huge increase. Uh, the value continue to increase as we're doing more CSR activities in following years. Uh, improved working condition of workforce and charitable uh, contribution, uh, coupled with uh, other measures can help. Uh, our company with the C CSR uh, for the next three years. Thanks, Pete. So, uh, at the beginning of our financial uh, strategy, uh, we, we didn't take any loan at the beginning, and we, we just used our own money to operate the com company. It is because uh, we we didn't have a clear vision of the market, and uh, so the first three years, no, first two years, uh, we have a low revenue, and uh, to to get more profit, we decide to uh, take we decide to take loan at year six, year seven, and year nine, and it's about. Totally two forty thousand uh, dollar loan, and the year seven uh, to get more uh, money to op operate our company, we issue uh, forty. We we issue one thousand and uh, four hundred shares, and and the the first at the First year, the price of the uh, stock share is uh, 68, and after after three years, our our stock price increased to increased.
crystal two twenty three, um, and so we repurchase our uh, stock share, so so that we can control the value of the share. Overtime, 
we can invest that money and grow our company and grow our workstation. Um, well, if we had a do-over, which I wish we had in real life, but we don't. But if we have a do-over, we would focus on keeping our prices as low as possible and focus only on developing our product. The price increase will happen later on in the years. Um, also in the do-over, we would focus on introducing our CSR. As we explained, we introduced it late, like in year 10. I would have introduced our CSR, or we would have introduced our CSR at the beginning of the launching of the company. That way, the name brand and the CSR will work like together. If you say company, team B, they will know that this is our CSR. Playing with the CSR throughout the years is not the best way to go with it. And finally, if we have a do-over, we would focus on um, gaining back the market share and developing our retail outlets and online sales. And now for the lesson learned. So we learned that in order to make money, we need to spend money. And also we learned that we have to be have a flexible strategy to quickly adapt to any market change. We also learned that losing in one year doesn't mean that we lost the game. We still can make correction and adjustment of the mistakes and still bring profit in the future. And also we learned that drastic increases in prices are risky, uh, it's a risky move that should be executed with caution, moreover, when there is a slow demand. And establishing a brand reputation is crucial for value, credibility, customers' loyalty, and sell growth. This is our appendix. This shows the numbers that we developed throughout the years. You can see how our EPS, ROE, and stock price kept increasing. Uh, even our credit rating increased, our image. But the only thing that you can see, even though we had revenue increasing every year, our profit did not really increase because our market share decreased around some of the years and we couldn't recover from it. So if you see in, uh, sorry, in year nine, how the number dropped from 24 to 13, we were never been able to go back up to 24 again. And the same thing with the drones. It dropped from 20, sorry, from uh, it dropped from 26 to 20, and we were never being able to put it up more than 19.9%, not even 20. But overall, I guess we learned a lot, and the numbers, seeing the numbers and how you can grow your earning per share is hopeful, I guess, and we ended up running our own business. And hopefully we learn something from this project. So thank you. Questions? 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 That means yes, or you have a question? I'm good. I, I don't have. Okay. So the biggest question: Why did you drastically change? I mean, you went boom. Because Year nine. Why did you? We, our sorry, our price went from four hundred to six hundred in one year. Like we did not increase the price, and our rating, like went from maybe five to five point two. So the develop, like the rating of the product, did not go as up as we expected, but we dropped. Like the price went very high which was like, as I said, a shock to the customer. You're, you're telling me what you did. Why did you change? The price? Why? No, no. The You're the question. Why did you change? Not what you changed. Why did you change? We wanted to, like, compete in a higher end, like, okay. level in the market. And we thought that if we change our strategy to best cost, we can compete at the higher end with a lower price which did not really play to our favor at the beginning. And that's the reason I see even we change that strategy, we still make more profit. Not only to the pay we make more profit.
Okay. I mean, why do you keep talking about year five, by the way? Year yeah, nine. all your charts. No, all your charts are start with year five. The game started at year six. That's what the highlights give us in the global. Okay, so you didn't do anything in year five. Yeah, it was like. A That's everyone knows. Okay, on the product and marketing strategy one. You had 